Right guys, welcome back to the channel. We're here with episode four of reacting to the NFL Top 100. Today is Cooper Cup. The guy's an absolute demon. When I do my NFL route running as a joke in my live videos, I call myself the Cooper Cup of England, just trying to get all swazzy with it. He just, he's so quick, so smart, catches the ball. His route running's incredible. And I can't wait to watch his highlight clips. I think, what did he get, like, Offensive Player of the Year? I can't remember his exact award, but he was a joke. It was unbelievable to watch this season. So make sure you like, comment, subscribe, smash that subscribe button now whilst you're here. And yeah, let's get straight into it. That time he, he had a touchdown and he broke it down like post game. That post game interview that he had that went viral speaks to the kind of like football IQ he has. Yeah, they said a little three deep fire zone, brought the nickel off the edge, safety drop down. Uh, it didn't look like they were doing a replacement fire zone, so I knew at the back away we were going to get three pushing through. Um, I had an opportunity to kind of run in there if I could beat my guy and just had to beat the safety to the end zone. Thank you so much. Most people that watched it had no idea what he was talking about. Cooper Cup just what so patient, about? trying to show that quick out route and then breaking across Wingard's face. Unfortunately, it's Wingard's birthday today. <laughs> Poor guy. That's so smooth. Last year, he wasn't ranked. My favorite play from last year of mine is my, my own play. Um, I think you got to go with uh, the last play of the Super Bowl for the, for the offense. Now with 129 remaining in regulation in Super Bowl 56. You know, we get a little run alert out to the outside. We got cover zero. You know, Matthew was able to give me the little... I remember you know, this play so clearly. Peek out there. I was like, okay, we're, we're getting this thing up and down and put it in the right spot. It's second and goal from inside the one. Stafford from under center. Steps Shimmies. back. Throws the fade. Back throws it up. Cooper Cup got it. Touchdown, LA! It makes it so easy. It's hard to imagine a receiver having a more fairy tale season than Cooper Cup. We're going to Disneyland! Woo! He became the first player in 16 years to lead the league in receptions receiving yards, and receiving touchdowns. The stat. rare receiver, Triple Crown. Triple Crown. What he's been able to do, leading the league in receptions, yards, and touchdowns. For me, uh, number one player on this list, definitely Cooper Cup. The Triple Crown, everything, I say he did number one. Best on my position, one, uh, Cooper Cup. Lead his team to the Super Bowl. Uh, it's hard to go against Triple Crown on it, too. By capping his year off with a Super Bowl MVP performance, Cup may have had the greatest season by a receiver in NFL history. My statement. favorite Cooper Cup play is we were up in Seattle on a Thursday night game when he came wrap around and threw a shoulder into Jamal Adams, bumped him into the corner, and ended up springing us for you know a 30-yard game. I mean, Cooper Cup just erased the highest paid safety in the game, Jamal Adams. <laughs> You know, he's got over a thousand yards and he's out there to help us Shifted get the, him out of the way. run play. As great a year as Cooper Cup has had, he's the best wide receiver in the league that I've seen this year blocking in the run game. And not only is he good at it, he loves doing it. I enjoy watching Coop. I always I always tell him if he's having a good game. If he's having a good game, I'm letting you know, hey, you're balling, brother. He's sneaky with his route running. Cooper Cup. Sitting at some running back. Really, really Kyrie Willis, easy. he has no chance. Cooper Cup puts a move on him. I should have seen what Cooper did to that safety. Oh Side-stepping, buckled it, put him on his ass. Including playoffs, Cup had 178 catches for 2,425 yards and 22 touchdowns. He's one of the league's best route runners, one of the best at catching the ball, and one of the best after the catch. Oh, that's filth. That's filth. Probably my favorite play, he ran this route. So it's like, uh, came up, ran out, ran back in, ran back out uh, against Tampa Bay. And then he scored a touchdown. This route is unbelievable. My goodness. I mean, how do you cover that? He 
kills us every time. And we got some good DBs. And like I watched versus Carlton the year before. That move he just put on Carlton Davis, oh boy. Carlton's driving on it and he whips back out and it's like, dog, like this guy's savvy. That is Phil. Cooper is able to find the weaknesses in the defense that he's going against. He's always looking at the surface pro on the sideline. We spent uh, so much time together um, before practice, after practice, in the meeting room, on the field, just constantly talking, trying to figure out ways that we can be better as a team and uh, as a combination. The amount of time that we spent together was a lot, and uh, I think it showed up on the field. Oh, and crunch time on third and long. Third down and Cup. Cooper Cup. This man does, does it like, as a good huh? football like oh, you. I mean, another step. I mean, does his film studies. Yes. Six inches. Yes. It was that attention to detail that made Cup the Rams' go-to receiver in the postseason's most critical moments. Big play. It's Cooper Cup. He set up the game-winning field goal in the divisional playoffs and again in the championship game. Cooper Cup with 26 on third down and three. In the Super Bowl, Cup delivered on the game-winning drive. He was that go-to man. Is this the it's slump? A oh, it's a jet sweep. He inside, he's got it. Super Cup, keeping the Rams drive alive. For the highest ranked receiver on the top 100, it was a perfect ending to a storybook season. Cooper! Great job, man. I'm so happy for you. Love you, man. Way to go. So proud of you. So happy for you. Cooper Cup, you win, and a memory that will last a lifetime. Congratulations, by the way. Thank you. Awesome. What a player. He looks like such a nice guy as well. That is filthy route running. The one he did on Carton Davis, where he goes, zoop. And then as Carton Davis goes out the way, he goes, look, see ya. He's just, oh. Stuff like that is so clean to watch. What a player. What a man. He definitely deserves to be the number one ranked wide receiver after that season. Just some of them clips. Like, you don't see many DBs, like, fall over after like such clean route running. Just so impressive. Cooper Cup, well done. Well done, Cooper Cup. All right, next one's episode five. I don't actually know who that is yet, so we'll find out in the next episode. I'm gonna have it as a playlist, so click on the next one if you wanna see my reaction to number five. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one.